Good, and you? How you doing? Doing all right. What are you all up to? First, can I get your name and the police number? Yes, sir. It's uh, going to be Officer Voights, Airport Police. Badge number's 59. Oh, y'all are different from Metro than y'all have. Yeah, uh, yeah, we're not Metro. I mean, y'all mean y'all's numbers are different. As far as? Like, they use employee numbers. Oh, okay. I mean, we have those, too. Oh, you okay. wanted that, yeah. But we have our badge number, if you wanted that. Yeah, that's... Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, what are y'all up to right now? Nice day recording and doing some you. videos of the. I didn't even know there's an upper space here, honestly. <laughs> okay, yeah. Um, they're the ones who called. Yeah. Uh, I guess they just noticed, you know, three guys standing out recording. Is uh, it illegal? It's not, nope. <laughs> I was about to say it's not illegal. Just letting you know. That's Jesus, here. here comes two more guys. I'm just letting you know. That's if it's I'm not here. illegal, then why is all this going on? Well, they. Uh, it's. Said. Yeah, guys, we got live contact here with the uh, airport, uh, airport police. <laughs> no one's saying they're in trouble. Like right. I said, they just called. I'm just making sure everything's all good. If y'all are, we're just, just journalists gathering yeah. content for a story. What's it? Okay, that's, that's all fine. We're doing. Yeah, that's fine. Like I said, I was just. It's my job to come out if they call to make sure everything's all right. Yeah. So yeah. From what I'm curious, I mean, I'm good with it. The first all right. So, cool. uh, I understand you're yeah. exercising y'all's right. You know, so I'm fine with that. I, that's that's my main priority is to make sure make sure y'all have your you know protect your rights. I'm not out here trying to hem anybody up. So okay, all right. As long as y'all aren't like trying to run through the gate. Oh no! Oh, no, 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 no. Like uh, if y'all want to make uh, y'all want to talk about violating the law. People there's running a, stop there's signs. There's a white Camaro that did not even stop. He sped from zero to 20 miles an hour in like two seconds. Okay. I've got it on camera. Yeah, I got it on camera too. Okay, I got you. I don't know, officer. Can I get so maybe y'all might want to set up out here and watch it because they're running the hell out of oh, it. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, that's all. That's all it is. Then. We'll get to y'all's hair, all right. Like I said, as long as you're not trying to jump the fence, run in there, do anything crazy. You know? and we got another one over there, guys. Yeah. Coming this way. That's our supervisor. Oh, that's the supervisor. Yeah, that's just our supervisor. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, um, but yeah, I mean, like I said, just don't do that, and we'll be. Oh no, okay. we're not. No, we're, we're not even. Not. We're just, okay, y'all. Before actually, we've been quiet for um, a minute. He's a good friend from one of those uh, airport police out here. His name's Justin. Oh, Justin. What's the last name? You know, last name. Burnett. Yeah. Burnett. Okay. Yep. Yeah. He works just, nights. Yeah. 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 He's a he's a good dude. Yeah. He told me if I want to do a ride along with y'all, just let him know and yeah, contact yeah. somebody and say yeah, do a ride along. Yeah, we 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 don't do them often, but we we will do them. Thank you. I can't even remember the last time we had one. I think it was like two years ago. Right. Okay, since you know what we're doing is not illegal, right? Mm -hmm. Could you go educate them? So that way, if somebody else comes out here and does this, they don't call the police on them? Right. I mean, yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I can talk to them. Uh, they're, you know, they're security. They don't. No, he's double loaded. What's that? He's got two people in his car. Are they training? Oh, yeah, he's training. Oh, yeah, okay. He's in, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, yeah, I'll go talk to them. Make sure, you know, that they know everything's all And good. me and him, me and him, we do cop watches a lot. Mm -hmm. So Metro knows us really good. And okay. they, like you said, as long as we don't violate the law, they yeah. let us do what we're supposed to do. And what yeah. they, what we're and have anybody who obeys the law, we're probably the ones that walk the line perfectly. Yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> yeah, we I mean, know where we can and can't And, and that's and the thing. It. Most of the people, you know, it, it's amazing how many people are, are ignorant to their rights, you know that kind of thing and that's why we do what we do protecting them are ignorant to it too so it's it's an issue so you hey, know i appreciate you. what y'all do pretty good can i get your name and uh, badge number on both sure. of please that's why we do it yeah. so yeah, educate absolutely. education i appreciate that i'll try to remember that one <laughs> i'll give you that okay his name is how do you say your last name I'm gonna go talk to them how do you say your name Del Hammer and you are Cecil thank you I missed what what all y'all were saying to we're just independent journalists gathering content yeah. for a story okay. so you're writing a story or something yeah and exercising our rights okay. don't get tired of exercising <laughs> <laughs> I don't know hey if you don't exit it's nice. like exit rights are like muscles if you don't use them you lose them 
That was the best dad joke I could come up with. Yeah. <laughs> Appreciate it, apparently. It was a good one. It was a good one. Well, I'd rather be... He's going to educate them, guys. The or something and standing on the side yeah, of exactly. Tonight. Or Donnie, just a regular old meet and greet. To each their own. <laughs> so, as long as ain't nobody causing anybody any trouble. No. Nah. Y'all are live, by the way, on... That's my uh, world, basically, because you're on the web, but... Right. <laughs> never been on TV before, so I'll take it as a compliment. Yeah, y'all don't get no... Most, uh, most people turn their cameras off when we're around. Even local media don't even cover y'all. <laughs> That's fine. Y'all don't, don't carry the uh, body cams? Not yet. Wow. We're on the way. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I seen it on the news that by like the end of July, y'all are supposed to be outfitted. Yeah, so Metro's working on getting theirs rolled out, and we're trying to follow suit. It's... I see all the it's a right. whole... It's a whole process, man. There's a whole lot of... Computers to be bought and software and all that. Mm -hmm. to say. Oh, we know all about that. But all sure. the all the cars got uh, cameras in them and audio recorders and that sort of stuff. So, but yeah. So you're training. Mm -hmm. You like it so far? Yeah, I do. It's nice. <laughs> really enjoying. It. How long you been doing it? Uh, couple, couple months. How much section of national do y'all have authority in? Well, well, jurisdiction, I should say. That is a very heavy question for me to answer on while being filmed, frankly. Depends well, on who you ask. It brings, it brings you a question, the reason why I was yeah, asking. So there was a traffic stop that I covered about three weeks, three months ago. No, it's been about four or five months. And uh, Airport PD pulled over a car that was actually on Metro's jurisdiction. Okay. So, so that's the reason why I asked where y'all's jurisdiction so I'll, I'll, comes from. I'm going to answer it in a roundabout way. Okay. So you've got Bill Mead PD, for instance. Yeah. You've got Berry Hill PD. They're all governed Aren't by they the stopping street. people in Metro's jurisdiction all day long as well? Mm -hmm. We're kind of the same deal. So yes, we're assigned to the airport, or the airport police, so on and so forth. But for all intents and purposes, we can stop the vehicle anywhere in Davidson County and we're fine. Okay, that's what I'm trying to figure out. We're commissioned by the state of Tennessee, and then we're given police powers by the Metro government. It's actually who gives us... So y'all are governed so, like uh, uh, Barry Hill and stuff. Well, so all I'm, all I'm trying to say is you've got kind of other satellite agencies like us so in Nashville, like Barry Hill. Uh, uh, you would have had Lakewood Texas. back in the day when yeah, they were similar municipality. And they had their own police okay. departments. So, so do, and again, they're, they're, they're stopping people on Old Hickory Boulevard or, you know, Bellmead stopping people on uh, Bellmead Boulevard. That's all technically metro, oh. right? Because mm -hmm. it's... Or Davidson County. So if you were to arrest me, where, what jail would I go to? You go to Metro. Metro? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's neat. They have, they have done their own Thank you for planning yeah. out here. Because I'm just curious. Oh, yeah. Like, so I seen that traffic stop. And I know, like, it's a police. They got their own police force. Yeah. Stop somebody. They're like me, and you, and him starting yeah. one and getting commissioned right. to do it. Exactly. Know? Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, we've had. powers the same way. As far as precedent goes, we've had detectives stop people up in Madison and arrest them for free. Significant charges, no issues there. Because okay. again, we're within Davidson County. Now, again, if I go out to Mount Juliet for some reason in a marked vehicle, and I'm in Mount Juliet, and I witness, let's say, some domestic or something, you know, somebody getting the crap beat out of them, I got to do something. But yeah, I can't necessarily arrest them. So you're on the, okay. you're what you said about different counties not being able to arrest. Them. That's absolute. Okay. We're not, we're not like Texas Rangers. <laughs> oh yeah, Something. definitely. I wish I wish we had little star badges instead of those. It'd be nice. Give me a little Marshalls. <laughs> we spot a couple of U.S. Marshalls. They're pretty cool too. Yeah, well, we ever met one. Oh. Have you ever had to arrest another cop? I have. You have. Oh, wow. And you say for what? Uh, he was drunk. Drunk? So you actually drunk. was sent him to jail. Ah. Uh, Man. We did everything we could for him, but we had given him ample opportunity. We gave him every minute of every hour. So he day. actually went to jail and mugshot everything, right? Well, that's awesome. Wow. You're very Not really... awesome. I mean, not I awesome, you, but... I know I, what you're saying, but it... it well, a lot, a lot of cops want to arrest another cop, yeah. is why. It's yeah. part of their job, right? Across the line. We got to a certain point where we couldn't help them anymore. And that's the truth for everybody. Wow. Discretion is a huge thing in law enforcement. We try to exercise as much as we can. But sometimes people's on actions just put them, put 
give you no choice. Exactly. Oh, for example, if y'all had to been completely the other side of the spectrum from how you're being, we'd be having different conversations. Is everybody cool? Everybody's cool? Yeah, we're always... Sure. We also are always polite. The only time I, the only time I act an ass basically is if you come at me tyrant. Yeah. You know. Exactly. And try to violate my rights, then I'm gonna stand up, you know, and take me to jail. They're delivering pizza, please. <laughs> we all been. I didn't call. Cold sodas out here. <laughs> Hi, we haven't been here that long. Hey, right here. <laughs> He's paying. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the second time somebody's trying to get me to buy a bender tonight. Yeah. <laughs> I'll pay for it at least. He's like, we gotta go on a date first at least. <laughs> <laughs> Joking, man. <laughs> <laughs> what, uh, that an FN? You don't have to take it out. I'm sorry? Is that He's FN? Asking about you one? Smith and Wesson. Smith and Wesson? Yep. Oh, an SD? SD9. Yeah. Oh, trust me, I'm not gonna grab it with y'all around. <laughs> kind of force to happen. Yeah. Uh, I have a habit of reaching down and, you know, adjusting it, you know. I'm not going to do that right now, though. <laughs> I don't want to get shot. <laughs> not many people do. Just, you know, Tennessee's now constitutional carry, so I'm exercising that right, too. Uh, if y'all have, like, say, um, y'all... It's awesome that y'all are cool with it, you know. Something happened where somebody gets shot. Like, do y'all have your own crime scene, or does Metro come in? We have detectives, but we right, would so contact outside agencies. Okay. I mean, if it was a obviously if it was an officer involved shooting, yeah, we're, we're not going to investigate our own people. It's a good way okay. to get in trouble. Um, well, that's good because a lot of agencies do, you know, all, investigate themselves. And it all depends on. It's kind of, you know. We need the help. We're not afraid to ask. It'd be like y'all coming and saying I committed the crime. I'm like, well, let me investigate. You know. <laughs> you stand right there and I'll tell you whether I did it or not. <laughs> you know, <laughs> I've got so many Metro cops on my channel saying that Metro can't afford crime scene tape, but we need to be back. I'm like, really? <laughs> yeah. We've had, we have. doing a heck of a job with what they've got right now. That's for sure. I spoke to one uh, uh, MTA bus driver when uh, you heard about the shooting at the Walmart and cars on the bike. Yeah, it was a couple weeks ago, right? Yeah, we, yeah. Uh, we heard, exactly. we asked her. We were there. about how Nashville getting, because she's getting her all her life. She says, nowadays, you can't really tell. It's one of the things getting like Chicago. I mean, I used to live in Chicago. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty nutty. I think it's, yeah. The violence there is pretty bad. Uh, yeah, not at the same <laughs> the But I'm an outside person. I'm an outside person, so I'd have issues, you know. <laughs> well, but it's um, 20 degrees below. Oh, yeah, yeah. I just talked to them, let them know that, you know, y'all are good. As long as, like I told told y'all, don't climb over the fence, don't go through the fence or anything like that. I know you're... Sorry, it's funny, but, you know, yeah. didn't mean to laugh. But no, you're good. It. I, I know, so... Uh, Can we climb the tar? <laughs> that's, that's really good. I don't know that y'all want to try that. Uh, but, yeah, um, y'all are good, so I'll right, let them cool. know. All right. Uh, I mean the the military police here too. They they even said the same thing. They were like, yeah, we don't we we knew they were out here just you know pretty much exercising rights. So, right, exactly. Yeah. That's all we're doing. Yeah. So they don't have a military police doesn't have a problem with it. We don't have a problem with it. Uh, so the guy inside that called y'all's now knows, right? He knows. Okay. Yeah. I told him, uh, and you know, so they they should be fine. Shouldn't give you all any trouble. Okay. Um, but yeah. Y'all have any questions for me? I just have one question for the yeah. uh, Do, do y'all also have like uh, FTOs that wear the two bars? Yeah. Or because so y'all kind of y'all kind of rank like the, the police department, but not that police department. Kind of like y'all own. Yeah. So like what you're thinking of is oh, like you're canine stripe too. What's that? You're canine. No, oh, no. We just okay. got these approved. Yeah. These outer carriers. Uh, our FTO stripe would have one. Or excuse me, our FTO patch would have one stripe on it. You're thinking of like Metro does an FTO, but then they'll also have some corporals or FTO, so they'll, I believe, have two. I might be wrong about that, but we just skip the corporal and call it. Okay. All so, what about uh, one more question before we get out y'all here? Do y'all, the self lieutenants also wear the gold bar? Say Look at the initials. Do y'all wear the gold bars too? Lieutenants, yeah. Look they at the, the initials bars. on them. Yeah. Yeah. We call them. AOA. <laughs> they take uh, yeah. the stripes off and they the <laughs> bars up top. Wow. Yeah. 
Wow. <laughs> Hold on, I, I'm gonna zoom in on your tag right there because he likes your initials. Of your yeah, tag. the AOA. That's kind of yeah. ironic. Uh, they all got it. Well, sir, we're good. I wanted to ask y'all, how do y'all feel about the uh, citizens now being able to open carry? I mean, me personally. Yeah. That's fine. I mean, I as far as doing this job and as far as walking around life. It's a good practice. Just assume everybody's armed until you're proven otherwise. I think an armed society is a polite society. You know, <laughs> we'll find out. if if everybody's got a gun, I mean, you know, and you're now that we're you're allowed to carry your gun everywhere with you without having to have permission from government. You know, mm -hmm. I think it'll be a lot nicer. Yeah, I mean, you know, because everybody knows everybody got a gun. They ain't gonna try to pull a woman's got a gun. Yeah, yeah, if you're standing in the store, you're walking in the store getting ready to rob it, and you see six guys in there wearing a gun, are you gonna rob it? You ain't gonna do it. <laughs> you know, <laughs> think about it. <laughs> Probably not gonna try it. Yeah. So, all right. All right. 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 Preston, you got a question? Bob, appreciate y'all. Can, can I shake your hand? Thank you. Yep, thank you. Y'all be safe. Can I shake your hand, man? I'll, I'll wait oh, okay. thank you. <laughs> Don't do a little crossover. All right, I'll do it now. Hey, Crosby. All right, man. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, sir. Y'all right, be safe. <laughs> well, guys, that went pretty good. That's what it's about. That's exactly what it's about. That's what it's about, guys. Huh? Yeah. They're wearing my initials and don't even know it. All right. Well, guys, I guess me coming here the last time and the videos going viral on some big channels made a difference. So that's what it's about, guys. Education right there. They got educated and now you seen that? And the guard shot guy educated. And he actually went up there and educated them. That's awesome. That's awesome. And not one of them had a problem that I'm exercising my Second Amendment right. Why do you look kind of good that you're doing that? Y'all can see. Smith & Wesson SD9, 9mm. Well, that is awesome, guys. We had, we had a pass with the um, Air Force Police, and we kind of had a slight way with a fail with the uh, military. But they got I'm gonna zoom in for y'all because when I was live, it sucked zooming in, so I'm gonna get y'all a good little shot. So not only did the military get educated, but the police were already educated prior. Yeah, he said the MP police were good with He's it. He's the one who educated yeah, them yeah, last time. The L D O L. I didn't do it. The people did it. Yeah, that's the it. The people who called and they did it. I just showed up with a camera and exposed it. That's all I did. Exactly. And that's what it takes sometimes. And then it goes viral, and everybody finds out, and they find them on YouTube. And they're like, well, you should have done that. And I don't see them this time. Hiding or anything like they did last time, uh, uh Last time they were sitting, they pulled right over there and sat and watched me walk out all the way to the end of the road. He's no longer recording us. Nope, he's not. And that's what it's about, guys. Edumacation. So, with that being said, y'all make sure to leave a comment how you feel about this audit. And leave a comment for the cops. I'm sure they'll see it. Be sure to smash that like button. Share this video on every platform of yours. Be sure to go over and subscribe to News Now Preston. Go over and subscribe to News Now Nephew. Their links will be in the description. And I will see you guys in the next video.